Coach Charlie Pfeiffer, uh, congratulations on a big uh, win. 23-16 over Adams State, 16-16 uh, heading into 285s, and, and then Sammy DeSerere with the uh, with the pin. Talk a little bit about the, the duel and, and his performance in that last match. Yeah, just, you know, kind of like last night when it was going to be all 10 guys that that put the put, that were putting in work and, and uh, going to have to come through in order for us to win that duel. You know, Adams puts 10 good kids on, on the mat at every single weight. And so you know, there's a couple that, that's some weights where I thought we could get the win and, you know, things just didn't quite go our way and, and maybe we didn't make our own breaks. But, uh, you know, the, guy, the guys came out firing and, and guys came out looking for big wins. And so, you know, it, yeah, what a, what a night. How, how much fun was that? And, you know, when Sammy threw him the first time, it was kind of like, okay. And then, and then he locked up again. And, and Sammy's dangerous there, but it's also got us in trouble a few times and, and launches him again. And then just to have the, you know, to, the, just the grit to stay on top and, and get the fall there was, was awesome. So, you know, hats off to Sammy Young. You know, he's, he's a sophomore and, and, you know, like he said, he's pretty nervous going out there. So just hats off to him for going out there and having a performance like that. Well, and like you said, uh, to begin the, the duel, things didn't quite go your way. Um, had to battle back um, and then uh, really turn the tide there. Uh, Hunter Mullen with a, a major decision and, uh, and then things kind of got rolling. Yeah, Hunter Mullen coming out and, uh, you know, the kid's a good kid. He, he uh, doesn't give up a whole lot of points and Hunter stayed patient, looked for his opportunities and then took advantage of those. And to put a major up on a kid like that, a veteran kid, uh, hats off to Hunter Mullen. And then Supernock coming back had a, um, a kind of a different match for him. Uh, got a little bloody there and, and match had to be paused a couple times, but still battled and uh, came away with a win. Talk about his performance. Yeah, Soup, I think what you've seen the last two nights is why he's ranked number one in the country. You know, I think he's given up the first takedown both times and he just stays the course, he stays the course of the whole match and he stayed the course over the last five years and, and that's why he's in the position that he's in and just he just wears on guys. They can't handle his pace. He starts to open them up, <clears throat> starts to expose them. You know, next thing you know, he's, he's widening the gap and, and big points there. And how about the crowd coming down after uh, Sammy D got that pin tonight? Uh, a lot of excitement, a lot of energy in the building, Paul Wright Gym, and, and you finished the season undefeated uh, in Paul Wright Gym. Talk a, bit, a little bit about the advantage um, and the fan support tonight. Paul Wright Gym's been uh, electric the last two nights. I mean, the, just the support from the community, from the student body, you know, it just embodies what our guys are, are about, and they're getting out there, and, and they're making friends, and they're, they're in the community, they're working for people, they're building relationships, and those people come and support us. So. You know, those are those are big things, and it's it's just a fun place to wrestle. And our, the crowd gets behind us, and and we we uh, we build on that. Well, one more duel uh, this season out of Colorado Mesa. Second time you guys face them. Um, what can we expect from from that duel? Yeah, Battle and Bronson, huge match. Um, you know, they're 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 tough. They're going to be eyeing for us. They're going to be coming for us. And you know, it's. You know, I think it was it was kind of a, a blowout the first time. It won't be that way again. You know, I told our guys be ready for a war. They're gonna they're gonna come out swinging, and they're gonna have the crowd behind them. Those guys are gonna be, you know, at us and 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 against us. And so that's just something that we're gonna have to go out and and silence them and, and get some wins and and you know build on our own momentum. So right. they're a good team. We're looking forward to it. All right. Well, thanks again, Coach. Congratulations. Thank you.